But we got the win, and that's that's what matters. New streak started. Next time, maybe we'll go with the Burst Laser 2 option. But we were playing some Storybook Brawl. I unlocked a new hero last night off stream, I believe. Um, I think I earned enough Fairy Dust to unlock... I already had King Midas. I think I permanently unlocked her, but maybe I did that. I forget when I did that. I unlocked something, but I have a new hero. So the broken build that we saw the other day was Trophy Hunter with um, a bunch of other crazy stuff. What was it? Grim Soul. Uh, Lost Soul. Friendly Spirit, I mean to say. A uh, bunch of other crazy stuff. I think a Mimic Treasure with some other crazy treasures. So that would be like the ideal if we could try to make that happen. But uh, we're just going to see if we can get our first win of the day. And maybe we can even get a game with viewers. We haven't done a group battle with viewers for a while. Hmm. Let's go. I like Gwen, but I feel like I need to get better at Geppetto. Although, to get better, you just buy a peep, right? Go Gwen. I just like Gwen. Alrighty then. So I can buy all three of these next turn if I do this this turn. Or I can buy one this turn, cast that, and only buy one next turn. No, if I'm going to do this, we do it this way. Problem is one of those buying, we'd be buying as a Humpty, which I don't love, but we do that. He'll die to anybody with high attack. Oh, good into an evil. That's actually great. Beautiful. We'll do that so we have a bunch of people who can actually attack. <laughs> Very nice. And we don't even have a Humpty to die on us. It's a pretty darn good start, honestly. Alright, would I knight something early? I think I'd prefer to save this for later when we have a build direction going on. Yeah, it's quite a good start, really. Chance at a triple, a little bit of synergy with evil and supports supporting each other. That's an easy win. Didn't give him anything, didn't give him anything there. No gold and no extra unit. Awesome. Okay. So I could go Wizard's Familiar Knighthood. Do I want to do that? Commit to a spell game plan. Whatever we do, I think it always involves buying these two. Now the question is if I use that. I feel like I often stop using the wizard's familiar later. I don't think I want to do that. Maybe I should, but I prefer to save it. Oh man, this was close. Not close enough. Okay, at least we didn't give anything him anything for the win except his Humpty Dumpty not dying. Evil character good and given it health. I want to freeze for that. 
Uh, of course. <coughs> At least you get your sleigh. That's good. Wow, you have a really full board already. Jesus. Oh, man, we just buffed you like crazy. Look, how do you... So sometimes people just have full boards out of nowhere. It's crazy to me. All right, we can do this. Transforms you. We can buy. I can sell. You for you and then give you buffs. And that makes you a uh, 3-3. Three, three. Do I ever actually get you to slay? Probably just do this and maybe try to get you in later. Let's just start to a potential Royals build if I can get a if I can get both these upgraded and then ride on four, roll down for a Prince Arthur. We could just do the most basic Gwen build. Full on Royals. Might be what I go for. Is not a bad start for that. <clears throat> All right, last place, Merlin. What you got? Nice. You actually hit one. You could slay. Thank you. That's a good hit. All right. Good win. Good win. Care about any of those? I have a triple opportunity there. Any treants? I could, I could complete this, or I get close to completing this quest now. Double up you, I think. Seven one six three. Let's go to six three. Hey, what's up, Moon? No, hey, uh, it's going pretty well, my friend. It's going pretty well. We're surviving. We are surviving, <laughs> thriving like MacGyver. That's how we're doing. Having an actual full day of streaming is nice after how uh, busy we've been lately. So we have a potential next turn. I think I might, if she gets her sleigh, I might just roll straight down for Prince Arthur. Because if all I have to do is cast Knighthood on Prince Arthur, and I'll have three units that will start to scale up really quickly. So that might be worth going for. Oh god. I don't think we have anybody who can slay. Okay. Holy shit. How are your units so big? How do you have a level 5 tri- Oh my god, you tripled blind ma mouse, that's how. Well, I'm almost dead because of that crap. Jesus Christ, that's insane. Well, I'm just going to try to roll down for that anyway. Oh, crap. I got to take a Romeo, though. Too good. Okay. All right. That's amazing. We get this. Uh, man, we are so low on health. Let's go with the Ring of Regeneration. Do I think you're more likely to get your quest completion done with more attack or attacking earlier? I honestly don't know. But you are going to be giving 8-8 eight, eight and buffs to the two of you, so... It's a good royal start if I wasn't at less than half my health right now. Oh, it's Grisham! No, right back at you. How are you doing, sir? Hope you're having a good one, my friend. Actually, so you're going to be bigger because of the plus four, plus four. Okay, all I want is for you to get your sleigh. If you don't get your sleigh, we could potentially get Grim Soul to force the sleigh. We have to go there to get the kill. Damn it. Worst frickin' hit, man.
Are we dead with this guy? Okay, we kill him. Jesus, all these... This is so insane. We are so strong and we're about to die, man. This is so ridiculous. This is what I've been running into lately. Just people who are killing others this fucking fast. Actually insane. I need a Juliet or something. Okay, and there's Grim Soul. So, if we do this... That's our best chance here. And then I need probably some spell help. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this. Something like that. Yep, yeah, Grim Soul was added in the last patch, which was like a week ago or something. And the most broken build I've seen ever was yesterday at the beginning of stream against somebody who had a Grim Soul on trophy hunter and some other crazy crazy stuff seven million plus attack unit that got proc from good boy and boom soul shenanigans god i'm so dead okay that procs that but yeah that's probably the best hit there your range units are not ridiculously strong at least so is there any way... Nope. <sighs> this is what's happened to me lately. I... I'm like... I was really strong. And we were gonna scale, like, effing hard. And we died in, like, five turns. That was really insane. Lately, it seems like everybody I fight... Every, every lobby's got at least two people who insanely high roll and kill everyone off. Really goddamn fast. It's insane. That was about as good a royal start you could have without having something completely broken. All right, I want to. Here's the Sphinx again. This is one of the new units. Uh, who was it yesterday? Um, the Scott Free telling us that the way you want to do it is you want to get a. You just want to freeze for a expensive spell when you level up is that right oh there you are speaking of scot free experience spells on 3.0 4.0 5.0 so the turn before you're gonna level automatically you want to freeze an expensive spell so after you level you can get the free experience is that right Gotcha, gotcha. So on 2... 2.2? 2 .2, is that what it is? On 2.2, .2, I want to freeze if there's an experience spell. Although I don't know if you can get an experience spell on 2 or not. Oh, that's great. Okay. Which spell do I want to do? The one that gets me two units, probably, right? Yeah, I think that's better. A 2 5 range, let's go. So we're hoping we roll an experience spell next turn and we freeze for it. I wonder if it's worth rolling down for that. I don't know the rules on which spells can appear when. Nice. No permanent buffs for you. Like, should I shrink spell this turn and then freeze, and then I'd be freezing a roll? 
think I should do this and hope for a really good expensive spell next turn, maybe. But maybe I shouldn't really even be worried about the expensive thing until... Um, three, like you said, instead of turn 3.0 or whatever. Or I guess we're going to 3.0. That's really good. All right, wow. Well, last lobby, everybody's super strong. This lobby, everyone is ridiculously weak. Holy crap. Okay, well, that's a free shrink spell, which would mean that's two, four, five, six. I could sell one thing and buy everything, I think. Probably pretty worth, right? Sell Humpy so he doesn't die. Do something like that. Probably that, actually. So I don't know if maybe on the previous turn, or even on this turn, if I should have just rolled until I found an experience spell, if that's the way you're supposed to play this. But we'll try to do better with going to four, maybe. Wow. Okay, I said everybody else was weak, but you're pretty strong. Well, okay, never mind. We wrecked you. <laughs> never mind. You got wrecked. Give me my two gold. Nice. Shrink spell on three is pretty solid, too, though. You did that yesterday? Okay. You're gonna buy a 3D printer, and you don't know if it will. Ha you have money for sub this month. Sorry, that's o that's okay. You don't have to apologize for not subbing. You never gotta apologize for that. Whoops. Although we got Creeper, and I'm not really using it if I do it this way. I think I will do this, because I think this is going to be stronger right now. You're going to buy literally anything else, you're going to have to ask for all your sub money back. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, Shogi, just get to the sub the moon now. Well, then you, then you really don't have to feel bad. Oh my god, that is a giant freaking dude. These attacks are pretty darn bad for us, too, but we were never killing a 1627 Vainpire. Jesus. Oh my god. What a start for the fates. Okay, so this would be the turn that if I saw an expensive spell, I would freeze for it. Questing. That'll give me a level 3 treasure. I'm gonna do that and buy you. A level higher. That's going to complete your quest, actually. Okay, that gives us a level 5 treasure. What are you? A spell weaver. I think I might just roll down for Wish next turn, or this next turn if I can. Oh my god, you're so strong. Jesus. Okay. Well, we should be able to kill that guy and get gold, but... jeez. Uh, <laughs> or maybe we can't kill that guy. What the hell, man?
Okay, what do I do, man? What do I do? Alright, I'll take Turkish Delight, I guess. Not the wish, but... I mean, do I try to make a transition into freaking Treants here? No, man. Don't even know. Maybe I can do a friendly spirit thing, who knows. Okay, at least we got a slay, that's good. Mm. Oh man, a 9-8 ranged. I would never win in this. Maybe I'm maybe I'm playing more poorly lately, because I keep whining about other people high rolling, but maybe I'm just not playing it right. Okay, we can guarantee Brave Princess goes off if I Grim Soul. Do I do that? It's a Romeo and a Juliet. There's the end. I could freeze for that. Juliet, eh? <laughs> Maybe we can get some stats on those things. Uh, we're looking kind of dead, honestly. We might just be dead this turn. You're going to make a Steve from aluminum for you, but the setup is too complex for a machine. Maybe a 3D printer you can cast it with lost plot casting. Is it, it is Steve the drone that misses shots. Um, yes. Steve is the drone who's terrible. This looks like we're pretty dead. Yeah, we're dead. Oh, I have one health. Okay. Well, here we go. Level 5 treasure. Can this get us anything? Highest attack character dice. Summon it. Spear of Achilles. If I have a character of each level. 2, 3, 4, uh... Spear of Achilles, probably? Sure to get these guys to proc and play Romeo and Juliet, maybe. We can wake her up as we eat her. Um Yeah, I have kind of a nothing build, but who knows? Maybe we can get a crap ton of stats from some attacking friendly spirits here. Okay, we're fighting the ghosts, so we have a chance. We have a chance. Spear of Achilles with double friendly spirit could be kind of insane. Uh, 
That's a great ghost fight right there. Okay, all right, Arthur. Um, you would only be upgrading her. Another Romeo would be pretty insane. Fairy Godmother. Giving everybody stats. Maybe. Another Romeo, okay. How do we, do we play this instead of the Godmother maybe? Trying to get friendly spirits to give a bunch of stats to Juliet, then we'll summon her multiple times, maybe, hopefully. Alright, we get free spells next turn if we don't die here. Okay, that sucks. That means Juliet, that's one Juliet we lost out on. Units are getting pretty big, though. As long as you don't kill Juliet. Freaking hell, man. Well, we're gonna get one Juliet. Okay, that is... That's a win. Okay, all right. All right, free spell. What do we got? Those are not great free spells. Not great units. Let's roll for something good. Lancelot with the Spear of Achilles might actually rock fairly quickly, maybe. Ten health permanently. We want to do that on Romeo. I think that that's like normally a four, five cost spell. Make sure he doesn't die as quickly. Probably would have done plus HP on either Lance or Friendly Spirit there. I feel like Friendly Spirit might not be what I'm gonna play around. We'll see. Let's see here. Can't get an attack, but 22. And of course you attack that guy. Of course you do. But you gotta slay at least. You even summon a Juliet. Oh, man. Hey, you know what? That's actually a win. We got fourth place. All right, GG cookie time. I cannot believe that was considered a win. <laughs> that shows how horrifyingly crazy... Well, that lobby wasn't that bad, but... I can't believe this got me fourth place, and the last build I had got me sixth. This game is becoming more and more swingy, it feels like. I feel like it's so hard to get consistency in this game. I mean, random game, so it's not surprising, but... Hmm. Do a Wonder Waddle. Maybe we can do... 20 damage, turn 4, whatever happened to us from the Wonder Waddle last time. Because of like 4 upgraded units or something stupid. You're hanging around the top 200 people though? Well you got more, uh... I don't know, you got more experience, more luck, or... more skill at this game. Because I, I just lately cannot find any consistency. So many times I can't 
put together a build before I'm just dead, because people are... The high roll is crazy on this game. Man, happy little tree or a, an animal I can potentially double. I think you just gotta go all in on doubles, right? With this unit, or with this uh, character. All in on animal doubles. Freeze for kitty cup purse. Hmm. Wow. Amazing that we couldn't win with that. Of course, of course. Well, you are actually an animal. What a shitty game. The random spell it did was roll. Amazing. Maybe should have bought the polywoggle then did didn't do that. I was hoping it would get me polywoggle with a buff. This was kinda of what I was hoping for. Okay, um... First attack... Dark Contract, there are a lot of evil animals. Let's go with that. Do I freeze? You will become an animal if you transform. So one cost animal that you need to buy a princess for? I don't know. Wow, oh, man. Just so many units. Five units on turn three, man. No animals. Do I roll for animals? I'm gonna roll once. One animal. Oh, okay. Prize pig's an animal. This is so crappy and shiznitty and useless. Uh, this is what happens when I play Wonder Waddle. I got like no animals, man. I mean, cats would be good. There, there are so many other units that we could have gotten. Maybe we can double this guy. Man, we don't even stop you from slaying. We just gave him so much money. My god. Blind Mouse would be an amazing thing to double. Since you can guess the level 4 treasure. My princess to transform you, I guess. Uh, it's better to do it this way, I think. Make you guys as big as possible, I guess. Something like this. Actually, I think it's better if I do that. Guarantee he goes first to give that buff. Yeah, let's do that. Something like that. 
Let's guarantee what? Plus six, plus six from him. He's gives plus three, plus three to both. Nice. Very nice. Could you not attack the worst guy every time? Give you gold, but we win. So, cool. I do that to wake you up. No, I want to roll for other animals. Okay, okay, here we go. Um, Shepherd Sling is good since those are the units we're going to be upgrading. I'm going to freeze this board. At least we're finally getting some doubles here, so that's nice. Probably buy one of these and the cat, and then roll, probably. Maybe try to make a spell build happen now that we have an upgraded wizard's familiar, maybe. <laughs> okay, at least you get your attack off. Oh, you have one too. You have a bigger one than me, giggity lol, that's what she said. Pretty good hits, honestly, but God, how many how many spells have you cast on that guy? He's a frickin' 414. Jeez. This one health. Is there any way we can do a puff puff build? What kind of build can we make here? Whoa, you're a 9-7. Holy crap. A 9-7 ranged unit. Okay. Three's for monster book. Monster book with wizards familiar could be good. Maybe we can do a spell thingy. Worst attack, man. And the best spell for you, too. For your quest there. That's a good hit, though. Oh my god. But it's freaking Geppetto. <laughs> How's today, Ben? Um. It's been an interesting, challenging day, that's for sure. We had a pretty good start to streak in FTL and then got wrecked. So far in this today, it's not been great. Okay, that's really nice, though. I want to double up on the blind mouse because we can get some really good stuff going on there, if possible. We can get a level 6 treasure if we find a blind mouse. That is the goal. The goal. Get a level 6 treasure. We buy no double animals until we get blind mouse. 
and hope we don't die before that happens. That is the goal. Hope Monster Book can do some work for making the bigger wizards familiar and do some damage to the enemy. Translation is salty. Yes, salty is the translation. This is worst hit again, man. Good. Are we dead? We're not dead. But we are just giving gold every to everybody. Okay, there we go. That's great. Come on, level six treasure. Be something amazing. No supports. I don't have a unit of... I mean, of every level, do I have to have a level six for this? Because, yeah, this looks like we get level 7 treasure next game, is what it looks like. Shelter you're giving just two of those others. Okay. Maybe we can survive here. Watch it be the gold one again. Please tell me you'll at least get to attack. Thank you. Depending on our spells, we have a chance of winning this. That was not a good spell. That's. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just giving him buffs. Okay, that's good. Okay, I think our 28-28 wizard familiar is going to keep us in this, though. Okay, and we just got a bunch of extra gold from that. Okay, all right. Level 7 treasure, what do we get? All characters in my shop are freaking upgraded. Okay. Um... Okay, well, we want spell synergy. Um, what 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 do I want here? Level five. No, what am I doing here? Okay. I don't even know what to do with a... Chickens are free gold, you're right, they probably are. Dwarf build. Or dwarfs, okay. That summons that, okay. Darn, no gold for that. Yeah. Buy for two, sell for... Yeah, I think you're right about that. And I just gave you a bunch of gold there. Okay. All uh, right, we are still in this, though. Yeah, so if I see a chicken, I need to buy and sell it. Um, I don't know <laughs> what I'm trying to do here. Uh, Aeon, yes. Good into a random evil. I can't get treasures with this treasure, though. Okay, that's not really useful. 
upgrade Lancelot's pretty good stats. I mean, Southern Siren is pretty cool. Try upgraded sirens? This is such a strange thing we have here. By quest units. He is an 1818. Oh my god, you're giant. Oh wow, that was a nice double hit. You could get rid of Medusa. Yes! Oh, we summoned double Medusa! Ha <laughs> ha! Get wrecked! Path to slay, that's great. Nice. It's okay, they're just bodies to protect our back line. Okay, alright. Um, do I think Lancelot ever completes this? I don't think so. Trigger Slay. Maybe I should have taken her. I'm so confused about what I should even try to build. Okay, not anymore. We're spelling it up. Um, we'll cast and spells. <laughs> yeah, upgraded Puff Puff. Yeah. I have no princesses, though. I need to cast a spell. I'm just gonna do that just for the buff. Probably was not worth it there. Okay. It's a weird spell build kind of thing. Who did you just... Oh, that was the guy that turns all your health to one. That sucks. Well, at least you don't have a uh, Echo Wood. Man, Pigomorphs everywhere, man. Oh, man. I need a Herd of Slay to have a chance here. <laughs> yeah, I did. Ah, uh, man, I feel like, I don't know, man. What did I need? I needed ranged mages, maybe, for the back row to get buffs. Got me the six, though, I guess so. I can't, I can't get a cohesive build together, man. Am I, am I worse at this game? Am I unluckier? I don't know, man. I mean, for a while when I was playing in uh, Legend Rank, I... I was able to climb consistently. I cannot seem to put anything together lately. FTL luck? Maybe that's what it is. Yeah, it's one of the new ones, Share Bear. Kind of want to try it. Extra gold every round sounds pretty good. Even if you're giving other people gold. Um... Man, I'm gonna go Snow Angel. I've been having really bad luck with when you're supposed to buy certain types of units, but I feel like they can be brokenly strong. And even though there's not a good unit here, I think getting two units is worth freezing. I think that's the best spell on turn two. Hopefully we'll roll a good unit. Probably not, but at least to be able to buy two. And those are Two high attack units, so wouldn't be terrible to get. Yeah, that's pretty crap, but okay. Let's do that.
How do the heroes work again? If they're in the first two slots, you always pick them? Yes. If they're in the last two slots, only if you've unlocked them can you get them? Yes. Or do the unlockable heroes always only appear in those last two slots? No, the, the ones that I have unlocked can appear in any slot. I think every slot is random. But the ones on the left side are always free to play, pick. The two on the right, you have to have unlocked them to have the opportunity to play them, basically. Nice. Okay. Still haven't tried this game yet. Or do the unlockable heroes always appear on those last two slots? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's random for all of it. Even with a brand new account, you can play any hero. It's just once you buy them, you'll have more opportunities to play them. Yes, exactly. Basically, the more you unlock heroes, the more options you'll have for every game. You could spend enough money to just unlock all the heroes and you'd have four options every time. It's just always random where they appear, I think. That is some high health units, bro. Alright. <laughs> Cracking our eggs. Okay. Oh. Wish upon a star. Right, this gets us a random unit. What do we get? Okay. Do I have any slays? No, but I think I'll buy in a shadow a shadow session anyway. Got a bunch of ranged units can just be good. Bona freeze, wish upon a star. There's a good unit there. Please for. I should always buy chickens are not good. Humpties are good. Chickens are not. Yeah, it has to be good. It's a little confusing because it's a gold unit, but the, is the gold board? Is the board you need to look at to see what type it is? Oh, that was the best hit right there. Okay, we give you one buff, but otherwise get wrecked. All right, man. It's a weird board. I wonder if, if this hits Humpty if that counts as me buying. It does not. Hmm. Well, there you go. If you cast a spell and getting a unit from that spell, it's not considered buying for Snow Angel. Now I know. I wasn't sure how that worked. What if you get the good animals treasure? Then yes, any animal you buy would be considered a good unit. It's probably one of the better treasures to get with her. Now you have much better range units than I do. Oh my god, look at how freaking... Yeah, this is claws, man. Okay, well I got range units, so I could do some work. There's three supports in front with a bunch of summons, and this is so brokenly strong, man. Honestly, that went better than it should have, most likely. Okay, slays are good. Because they can get buffs on these. Um... Hmm. 
I think a bunch of 1-1s one potentially would be better here. If it's the rain, you just die. I think I'm gonna do that to give everything health. We have like no attack here. That's a 50-50 to actually slay. <laughs> and both failed. F me, man. Zero slay procs for my Shadow Assassins. Just amazing. Worst hits every effing time. Okay. No goods. No good units. There's a triple. There's a vein pyre. Trigger a slay. Grim soul vein pyre. Alright, maybe we can hatball it. Not very uh, confident about that, but maybe. Two worst hits. Hey, at least we got a slay, though. You know, amazing. Please don't hit that. Great. You get a slay. Okay, we got two slays, but we didn't get to proc our slayer because she died immediately to a fucking dragon, so... It's about as bad luck as we could possibly get every single time. Sounds great, man. Sounds great. Trigger slay. Probably too many slays, but what if we did this? Hope you get your buff there. Trying to do a slay build, but we're just probably going to die before we can get anything put together here. <laughs> Monkey's Paw Wish. Monkey's Paw, is that the one that gives, if you have less than 7, everybody a plus 7-7 seven, seven or something like that? We're getting slain build, yes. God, look at how the stats on my units, they're so low. <laughs> uh, I'm so dead. You get your slay. Hey, I did get a slay there. Don't even kill that off. Uh, okay. Where do we keep getting these random units from? Where did you come from? Oh, the Ogre Princess slaying, okay.
I'm glad about you. Oh, man. <laughs> monkey paw sounds cool, but would be cooler if sung by the Beastie Boys as Brass Monkey Paw, that funky monkey punky paw. That's right. I need to play, I need to play dwarves, apparently. Because I'm getting destroyed by everything. Well, you have Tree of Life. Okay, well, let's end this game. This is just put me out of my misery. Jesus Christ. Okay, seventh place. Not eight, yay. I'm trying to find synergy and all I'm finding is death every time. Do I try Sphinx again? Sure, let's try to learn this new hero, man. Pray for ball. No, I think Scott Free said the way he plays this is you just you freeze the turn before you level up. You freeze on an expensive experience spell. That's that's the goal. And maybe I just need to roll more aggressively for that. Although if you roll five, spend five gold rolling to find a five cost spell that you get for zero, that breaks even. So I don't just don't know exactly how you're supposed to do it. Three one ones, but I'll be able to buy all three of them next turn, so I, I guess. Yes. Loki got kind of screwed, actually. He got one extra gold at cost of two health, and he probably won't be able to do anything with it. He probably only has one unit, right? Good unit to get, though, on Loki. Double rolls, well. Another shrink spell, huh? Guess I'll freeze for the familiar. Maybe I freeze for the shrink spell on turn three. That might be what I do. I might keep that shrink spell for that next turn. Wow, you have a lot more stats than me on every single unit. Same units, more stats. cast any spells we never win this right so zero cost on a bunch of units that's probably going to be worth it i mean one one minus one cost for free on everything at five gold probably worth hopefully you get gold from this guy's slay gonna slay anything though. No. Alright, well we got one extra kill by getting that egg. <laughs> I don't know what the hell I'm doing. I don't know how to play the goddamn game. Alright. Dwarves, let's do it. Dwarf it up, man. Uh let's see. I kind of wish when you 
bought things at a cheaper cost, it wouldn't show their cheaper cost in the top left. Because that makes me think, that makes it look like Princess White is going to give you a level 2 tre tre treasure. And you got your sleigh. What's up, Cruel Angel? How am I doing? Losing at RNG, that's what I'm doing. But otherwise, great. Alright, no dwarves. Expensive spells. Just go all in on dwarves, maybe. I say as I find no dwarves. One dwarf. Three, three. Probably should have sold the kitty cup first and done that and then that. The usual, yeah, the usual. Usual bad RNG. Sounds about right. You're guaranteed as long as you don't get killed to get your quest done. Okay, what do we get? A dwarf. Okay. Alright. We get to try Tweedledee for the first time. Oh, that's a lot of... How are you a 6 of... 7, 2... Okay. Pretty nice pickup there. Okay, perfect. We freeze here. This is actually perfect. Uh, if we can, you know, not die and all that. Uh, so we want to do this, this. This and who do we want to sell? The cat. We do this. You're a one nine. One, two, three. Okay. This is going to be free experience next turn. I killed backline support, I guess. My build is crap, but we at least have synergy with our hero power. I wonder I can't find dwarves. 7-2, you become a 3-8. Interesting. Good. Alright. Any dwarves? There's a dwarf. Okay. Last breath. Trigger a last breath. Hmm. Look for more dwarves. Come on, dwarves. Okay. Um. We're almost there. Guess we gotta lose you. Okay. Now that's interesting because we get Cinderella and then do two spells immediately, but I think we're all in on trying to do a trying to do a dwarf build that is looking really, really, really terrible. Mm 
No, I think there's three different people trying to do dwarves. I've been avoiding dwarves ever since the new patch came out. I finally give it a try, and I'm just... Everybody else is playing it and killing me with it. It's amazing. Amazing how lucky... Lucky I am. <laughs> My god. Okay. There's that experience that I would want to lock in. If I weren't about to die. Okay, that's really good for this. Uh... Doors have plus two, plus two. I miss that on my hero power if I play that. I gotta roll for other dwarves. Okay, that gives all of my dwarves stats. And we get a lucky. Okay, that's really nice. Alright, we're gonna gamble. I'm gonna give them stats as well as me stats. We probably die from this, but let's see. Just gave all your units attack. 25-30. And that's a Juliet that's large and in charge. Yeah, that's GG. Eighth place! Yay! Yay! Seventh and eighth. Yay! I don't know how the hell to play this game anymore, apparently. I think I've gotten one fourth place today in over two hours of playing I've gotten a single fourth place how how the hell do you play this game I don't know how to play this game I do not know how to play this game anymore I'm gonna try this new hero this guy you need just two copies of upgraded character but you never get treasure so you can get a bunch of upgraded characters but you can't get any treasures so it's a weird playstyle. I tried to play with Royals one time, which seemed pretty good. Like, low-level units won't be that good for this, but higher-level units with good abilities on them, I think, can be good. It's like two Humpties. No, that wouldn't be good, because then you wouldn't get the treasure from it. So, um... Yeah, double Humpty wouldn't really be good, except that it'd make a giant Humpty. So, you know. Yeah, even quests get no treasures, correct. Correct. I'm freezing for the spell. Hope when we get a dwarf, we'll go with Fanny, because double Fanny would be plus four, plus four. Of course you get to go first on a ranged character. Of fucking course. Excuse my language. Can you tell I've been frustrated by this game today? Can you tell I'm frustrated by getting constantly destroyed by everything? I'm gonna put these in the front in case they do that spell that does two damage to the front row. I don't know if you can roll that on turn two, but my luck would be that they would roll that on turn two. Okay, we get a range, which means we win. We frickin' win. Beautiful. Okay, there's a dwarf. Oh, nice. Very nice.
Now, Double Wizard's Familiar would be really good if we did some sort of spell build. You just ATR the hottest Carolina Reaper Chinese work I have ever beepin' in my life and now I am looking for a grave. I have no idea what that sentence means. <laughs> Don't know what you're telling me. Got freeze for a polywoggle. The mad men. A double polywoggle could be something. Kill his egg. Oh crap. No, we don't because the summon went fucking hell, man. I summon one a second time. Alright, well, there's an upgrade there. Eat a hot chili and now wants to die. Is that what he said? Because I, I didn't get that from the words that were spoken. <laughs> hmm. Carolina Reaper or is a chili? Gotcha. Vine might be dying while typing that. <laughs> okay, don't don't die though. This a win. Two five. I think this is a win. Yeah, good. Okay. Now plus two plus two for every treasure you have is kind of worthless when you can't get any treasures, but. He could still have some decent stats, I guess. Any of you know this burn? The burn of a Carolina Reaper? Uh, I don't know. Alright, I'm gonna freeze for the polywoggle, right? If I get an upgraded, I could get an upgraded version of a higher level character. Oh, let me pick up. No freeze, no freeze. Of course he goes first. Let me still win this, please. God damn it, man. If I had gone first, we won that because I had more stats. It's all crap. Okay, that's good. Can't find another dwarf for Fanny to support, though, man. Somebody else playing dwarves? I wonder if I should just do this. 7 2, guarantee we get the 3 extra attack on that. It's probably better. Maybe this. Word on the street is Carolina Reapers are equivalent to eating a sun. <laughs> All right, Vine Leaf. Well, I hope your mouth survives the ordeal. And I'm sorry for your mouth eating a sun. You should probably not do that anymore. Nice. At least we got our finally our attack off there. But we're still losing because this guy's got his bigger wizard's familiar name than I have. Well, okay. That was a pretty good outcome, but we still get no buff from that, so. 
Uh, okay, copycat upgraded with Wretched Mummy. That could be a something. That could be a something here. Upgraded Trojan Donkey, could that be a something? The dwarf that could accept buffs from that, but it's not a very good one. I'd rather have a Tripoli, I think. I feel like I am getting worse at this game. And by worse, I mean I can't roll. Like, I can't get any synergies going. I don't know, man. I don't know. Give a permanent buff to this guy. It's probably worthless. Whoa! Freaking Nietzsche with the 50 bucks. Thank you, my friend. Holy crap. Out of nowhere. Okay, that's pretty good. No slay is good. Gonna proc that to do some 4 damage. Of course, get the guy that would have given us buffs. Is this a win? This is a loss still. We haven't figured out the best combo to use on Midas. Royal seems fine. Dwarves are okay-ish. Yeah, I can't. I can't find out. I can't figure anything out here. Monster book. The last breath. Maybe I can get some health here so that you can actually proc. Trying to do some sort of spell thing here, maybe. What am I trying to build? I have no freaking clue. I don't know what I should be trying to build. I think a last breath proccing spell thing. Something. Mages? Maybe I'm trying to do mages. I don't know. You don't think summons are very good? You always find them treasure dependent? Yeah, well, I'm definitely not trying to do summons, that's for sure. I usually get no hero no treasures with other heroes anyway. That's true. I think it might actually be better to do this. More likely to have him proc. Okay. We got all those procs off there. That's good. He goes. Okay. I think we win this. Uh, yeah, we win this. Okay. All right. Okay. That's pretty darn good right there. Copycat monster book thing. Do I care about that sleigh? I don't think so. And maybe even... Uh, he did give him stats. I'm looking for another copycat to double the copycat. Trigger last breath. Copycat Grim Soul. That would be for if I have slays. I don't really have slays. I don't think that works. Look for a copycat upgrade. Court Wizard. There's like one guy dominating, one guy close, and everyone else gets wrecked. I'm not even looking too bad right now. I'm kind of in the middle. I'm hoping for randomness to save me. Like it's been killing me all day. Double Cupid. Well. Okay, I get the double spell thing. Why don't we just proc this quest for him? You're welcome. Okay. 
think I win this, though. Oh, yeah. Unless there's some giant sheep in here, we're good. Nice. No giant sheep, okay. Basically, anything that doesn't need treasures to proc is viable, so naturally strong unit combos like Echo Wood builds. Maybe also Dwarves is essentially a free Dwarven Forge. Maybe, yeah. Okay, there's Aeon. Okay, how do I how do I play this? I think I still look for double copycat. Okay, more monster books is great. So maybe instead of the mummy, we just do this for spells. Still want you to proc. Maybe I don't care about buffing those. Okay. One thing I noticed is that you can never get quest units, which does weaken royal builds, yeah. Okay, we're going all in on casting spells galore. That's what I'm going for here. Okay, you proc that. I get to proc all of my spells, though. Okay, that killed that guy. That's... Uh, I was gonna say nice. Okay, that killed her. Thing is, this rotten apple tree is alive. Damn, he got a slay. Okay, this is actually fine. He's gonna attack and die on that. Oh, okay. Oh, look at that! Look at all these spells we got going. Nice. Okay, all right. Uh, wish upon a star. Getting to six. Is there anything on six I'd want? Storm King, whatever he's called. Get there one turn earlier. I don't die to this guy. Sure. Do I care about a double darkwood creeper? I don't think so. I'm looking for a copycat. That's what I'm looking for. Okay, all right. Oh, but I get, do I freeze going into six on it, though? I think I do. I think that's worth doing. A zero attack slot one. Yeah, if I find one. Did I have one? A lot of spells. That's what I'm hoping for. Yeah, if it dies first, we're screwed, and we probably just die. Nice. Ooh, you're doing spells too. Whose spells are better? Uh, so far, not so good spells, honestly. Yeah, that was pretty weak. That was a good hit. Okay. You have some range, though, which kind of sucks. This will get us a slay. Yeah, we're not dead. That was first place who's got forking rod spell build. Okay, so I want to roll for what? Another monster book. Health to an uh, evil character, good. Do I care about that? Probably I want some effective combat spell. Oh, another Aeon. All right, well, we definitely want that. Pigamorph. Hmm. Yeah, so they can't get Hermes boots. If only we could get Hermes boots. So 9, 12. No, I think we have to do this. We'll just have to get the buffs outside of combat from him. I could freeze to put her in the first slot just to... Uh, have a zero attack minion there. Although the problem is with all the random spells, there's gonna be a random spell that gives an attack to a zero zero attack minion. So I think the empty slot is just better. Getting dream out of Midas could be good. That's true. I should be looking for that. All right, what do we 
got here. It's a kill there. We get a bunch of gold. That's a kill. <laughs> nice. Get zappity zapped. Oh, get pigamorphed. <laughs> yeah! Eat it! Eat my spells! Oh, crap. He procced just a cat. It's fine. Yeah, no treasure hero. And we're doing spells galore, and it's... Kind of working. At least we're top four right now. I think this is my best King Midas run so far, honestly. Definitely my best run of the day, that's for sure. Do I care about two of those? Plain copy of a good character, but it's evil. Double Friendly Spirit doesn't really do anything here. That's free. Uh, I don't care about that. That is very nice. Oh, I should have done that first. Whoops. I still think the empty slop is better. I still think so. If he ever dies, we get screwed, but if we ever go first, that's basically our win condition, is going first. It's nice. <laughs> you summon and then you die. No procs for you, bro. Very interesting board, yeah. Spell builds are fun. It's rare that I get one that actually works. But I try to force it a lot, I think. So here we go. Maybe another copycat would be worth, though. If I put the first one here, that's still, what, four spells? And then second one there would be... a lot of spells. I think that's worth. I think that is worth. Oh my god, okay. 192, 177. Okay. At the worst, you get some spells off, unless a spell kills one of the two. Worse than, worse, worst case scenario, he's got a similar build that casts a bunch of spells that kill my front row units. But I think that's pretty... Unlikely. Yeah, Doom Breath hitting right here would be worst case. Going first and hitting this. Because that would kill off both our back row. Okay, then the Doom Breath, we go first. Nice. Oh, well, this is this other guy playing spells. That's a great hit. Okay, damn. All right, here comes a bunch of spells for him. Okay. That was not a good spell. That was not a good spell. I think my Storm King is big enough, though, that we're fine. Oh, man. I don't get any slay, so I don't get any cheaper spells next time. All right. I see your forking rod. So we're looking for another copycat. Or the thing to become not King Midas anymore so I can't get treasures. Yeah, another cat, another book. Uh, sure. I'll freeze for Pigamorph next turn. Uh, there's a lot of falling stars from random spells. Earthquake isn't level 2, it's level 3 per wiki. Okay, I don't actually know the level of the spells, so that's interesting. Well, damn. Oh, Jesus. 
He's got a freaking good boy in Echo Wood on Peter Pants. How the hell? How many freaking kisses did you get, man? Seriously. Oh, that's a good unit, too. Um, I think we still win this, though. Oh, Pigomorph, get wrecked. Yeah! Okay. Oh, he became Peter Pants. Okay. Oh, we have the ghost. Oh, we have the ghost. Well, then, let's not do that. This is a silly place. Why would you choose to be Peter Pants? Who chooses that? I don't think Echo Wood is good here. Might be worth taking it to... Deny it to other people, though. I think we're guaranteed to win. Okay, Pigamorph and another Aeon upgrade. Yeah, we'll freeze for that. Falling Stars is level 3. That is a giant Storm King, though. I'm keeping the Echo Wood just so that... Who is it? Whoever this guy used to be, the Peter Pants now, doesn't get another Echo Wood. I don't think we ever beat an Echo Wood. That fully unlocks that build we saw. Although it can't be as good as... He probably was looking for... Um, what's the one that we saw? Crazy build. Please don't hit the copycat. Uh, trophy Hunter is probably what he's looking for. Okay, good. Get our spells off. Nice. Oh yeah, he can't get another one from this shop now that he's Peter Pants. That's correct. We only have True Love's Kiss. Okay, we do this. We got a random Robin Wood. Okay. Pick a Morphit. We're top two, man. Two spells would be nice, but... Okay, is there anything I could put in that would make this better against his spell build? Should I put my big units in instead of having these procers? I think maybe this is better. Getting one is likely, getting both I feel like is not very likely. Or is going like this better? Maybe I want the most spells possible. I don't know if that's better or not than these bigger units. I'm gonna go with that though. You're turning a new leaf, play, leaf playing through FTL without F rage quitting. FTL isn't that hard. It's easy. Okay. All right. Well, this worked. So let's see what spells we get. Go off that. Okay. Kill that. Uh, kill that guy off. Might have been better. Oh yes, pick a morph the spell guy. All right. I think we got this. I think this is a GG, my friends. Although he does have mirror, mirror. But his Storm King is much smaller than mine, giggity. Although I don't know that we kill him this turn, though. He's got 20 health. Nice hit. That's a, that's a uh, slay, okay. <coughs> All right. Random enemy health to one is a pretty good spell. But I'd rather look for Pigomorph. I think I would rather look for Pigomorph. Oh gosh. Okay. That's probably worth. Looking for Pigomorph. Give you health to survive to your attack, hopefully. You have the Schwartz, and your Schwartz is as big as- I see your Schwartz is just as big as mine! 
All right, what do you got? So he played that. All right. He's got more bigger units. I'm hoping this guy will die. Oh, that was a bad hit for that. Nice. Okay, that's gonna make him have a spell. It's so crazy. <laughs> so many spells. Who spells are bigger? We have more, but you're Storm King. Because we have the double Storm King, I think this, oh, we're just going to outstat him. It depends on this, the Spell Weaver gets a hit off, I think. Okay, it's only a 1-1. One, one. Damn. Yeah, I think we're going to lose because of Mirror. Oh, that's a great hit. Oh, we got there. GG! Freaking GG, man. I'm GG Cookie Time in that. We got a freaking first place. GG Cookie Time. Took us all day, but there we go. The 472 360 Storm King on Midas. Apparently, that's one way you can get a first place on Midas. Let's go full spell build with a bunch of random crap. <laughs> Midas copycat mages. All right. Let's do one last run. Call it a day. I should probably end on a high note. But I'm addicted to this game, so. It's only one first place today. My first win of the day, I got fourth place. <laughs> After thinking I lost, but somebody lost worse than me. Oh, you mean ever? Uh, 49, I guess. Is that what this number is? 49. Let's go, Peter Pants. Let's see if we can go, you know, hatball. Crazy forking hatball or something. So, 49 ever. Collect first place crowns for bragging rights. How come they don't record how many last places I've gotten? I want to brag about how terrible I am. Or how bad my RNG is. Holy double blind mouse. That's one of the few ways to get a level four treasure. Let's uh, let's freeze for that, I think. I think I will freeze for that. Oh, I gotta get one more of them, but I think that's a, a good unit to get. That's like one of the few ways you can get forking for the hat bull. Forking for the hat bull. Forking a hat bull. Definitely not worth freezing a wish upon a star, though, I don't think on him. I'm assuming gender on Peter Pants, though. Maybe I shouldn't do that. Okay. Not freezing anymore. I'll roll. So, level 2 quest. Is that worth holding on to? Um, a Darkwood Creeper might be worth holding on to. I can't get both next turn, though. And I can't even cast that spell. This was not a good turn, too. I'm not gonna go for it. The level 3 quest girl, yes. This one, no. Please go. Well, okay. Either way. So it could start for him. Okay. I could go those two. I'd get a 5-5 five, five and a 2 unranged. But I think I want the bigger unit here. Maybe that will kill off some stuff. That'll give me six gold next turn. All right, I'll freeze for that. That'll be a five, five, a two, one, and one more unit, I guess. <laughs> one unit a turn's pretty bad. Okay, we killed the range, that's good. This is a win. As a win. Falling Stars probably got me that win, very nice. When they all get, they all get stats, very nice at that. That. 
and that. And how do I want to do this? Probably like this. Or do I want to do this? Or he's in the back. No, I think I want to do this. Alright, so I'm hoping for... Triple this guy and get Florking. Triple this guy and get Hat. And then triple some other three to get a ball. I feel like I've tried to force Hat Ball and... Peter Pants, I can never quite make it work. But who knows, maybe we'll have better luck today. God damn game. One out of four that hits the one that keeps us from getting our slay. On effing lucky, man. It's range. We don't kill his egg by one health, too. Jesus, you got double slay on that. What a frickin' start for that guy. You buy one, three, one, two, and the spell. Alright, let's do this, this. And this, so I can hopefully get you to get your sleigh there. Let's do it this way. I think that's better, I think. Definitely doesn't feel like a very good start on Peter Pants, that's for sure. So much range on that other team? Yeah, well, I mean, it's... Shadow Assassin is the best unit to get on Sad Dracula. And as soon as that Shadow Assassin gets big enough, that's just going to put Shadow Assassin in the first position to self proc it, I think. Yeah, that's a slay. That's nice. I think we win this one, though. Oh, yeah, we're winning this hardcore. Awesome. All right, there's a chance at uh, hat or ball. All right, well, Bad Moon for Vainpire is not terrible. Neither is Sting, but let's do that for permanent buff potentials. Potentials. So this is the unit we want a True Love's Kiss. We can get a level 4 upgraded unit from that. Uh, we could play, we could freeze her Black Cat, but I don't think we're really going to be playing around a Queen of Hearts build. Queen of Hearts does not scale that well. But I feel like this is a good target for uh, a True Love's Kiss um, spell thing. I really would like to find the third blind mouse, though. We've gotten zero of the uh, wizard's familiar for potential spell synergy, though. Tam, bunch of slave procs. Okay, looks like everybody's freaking playing shadow assassins today. Good win, though. So if I'm gonna try to do some sort of spell build, I think I do want you. I don't know that I care about trying to triple this these kind of units here. I want to take you just... Nah, I don't want to get you right now. Okay. I'll do that. Boom, dee, 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 boom. 
You're a 5-5 five, five range, so you're better than that guy. Okay. I like that. That's better. Okay, not a bad little board we have here. Not amazing, but not bad. Now we finally have a unit that can benefit from cast a bunch of spells if I can get some actual treasures going. They should add a turn counter. Yeah, I think that would be helpful. Yeah, that first hit. That's a pretty good hit, though. That goes twice. Um, that's a great hit. Yeah, we win this. Very nice. Give me the gold. All right. No level three quest guy. Anytime I give you buffs, I think it's worth doing to proc your your thing there. What am I looking for? I'm looking for blind mouse, vein pyre, spell weaver. Those are the things I want to get for potential. Quests. All right, I do like Mad Men, though. I think I'm gonna not go Shadow Assassin. I see a lot of people have other people have Shadow Assassin, and I only have one Slay guy. You have to buy dwarves to make that one work. There's a Wizard's Familiar. I'm gonna grab you. And there's a true love's kiss. We need to freeze for that. So. There, we're gonna true love's kiss her next turn. Let's see what level four we get. Is there a good level four spell unit? The last breath trigger guy. What's his face? Ooh, exactly full there. <clears throat> Why do you have such a small board? You must have tripled a bunch of stuff just now. That range was nice. Looks like our Queen of Hearts will be enough to carry us this round. Book is at four. Yeah, book would be great. Good call. Okay. Um, I mean, he's ranged and he's a mage. If we somehow could get a Aeon, maybe that would be useful. It's a triple black cat. Good into an evil of the same level. I wonder if I want to freeze that to get. So, book is evil. So if I do that next turn, I have a chance of getting book from that. I think I'm going to freeze that. I'm going to triple this. Questing higher level reward. Mm. I think I might just take the gold here. Although, I guess I could have taken the questing, and that would mean um, the spell quest girl could have given me hat or ball. If you roll past the quest units, can you find them again? Yeah, Cinderella. I think the one I'm thinking of is Cinderella. It would be bad for Brave Princess. Oh, man. Jesus, those are giant units. Speaking of book, though. Yeah, that's a good hit. Don't kill my guy. Okay, it's just enough to... Okay, we got one more kill. Not the end, not, not the worst thing ever. All right, you want to be a mage book? Okay, well you're a, you're a mage. Okay. What am I looking for? I'm still looking for spell weavers and vein pyres, which I cannot find. Um, God, I haven't found a third blind mouse yet either. Jeez. I 
I do want that. I'm gonna lose the triple opportunity there. Okay, there's another opportunity here. Frickin' hat, let's go. There's blind mouse, okay. And there's also a vein pyre. Um, I'm just gonna freeze. I didn't wanna be rushed on this choice here. Secret text of blind mice. There are only two blind mice. <laughs> good. Yeah, didn't hit our range. That's good. Okay, that's a tie. That's a tie. I'll take a tie. Okay, all right. So we're looking for forking. Forking hat bowl. Okay, Moonsong Horn. Moonsong Horn is pretty good too. Summoning portal, do I care about that? No. So let's do that instead of spinning wheel. Um take that. I think we sell him because we would like another chance at that. Okay, whew, all right. I think that's a no, right? I don't think I would lose Bad Moon for either of these. Although, I need to pick one to get out of the pool, don't I? Isn't you have to pick one to get out of the pool? I'm thinking of taking the Quiver to replace Bad Moon just to get it out of the pool. I feel like somebody told me that was the case. So I'm going to do that. I'm not 100% sure if it works that way, but I'm hoping that will improve our chances. What do quest completes give you? Uh, they give you treasures. I'm not sure I understand that question. All the ranged. Where's Tit, man? Where's Tit? Damn it, man. Okay, we're looking for, again, ha a ball. If we get ball, we are in really good shape. Come on, ball. Damn it. Keep replacing this and hoping we're getting level threes out of the pool here. This might be weird, but I think I'm going to continue selling her and rebuying one to give us a chance because we need level three treasures. Okay, well, there's Brave Princess. That's a chance at it, too. And I, for her to get it, I would need to buy um, doors, which I don't want to do. I could get Darkwood Creeper. Could be another chance at it. If I could triple that, maybe. Something like that. Am I, able to, am I going to play with chat and cookie time group? Um, you know what? We'll do one more run after this. Yes. Yes. We'll do one more after this if we have enough people. People in chat, let me know if you want to play. It's kind of late to try to make Brave Princess work, but we'll try. I'm up for one more game if we can get a chat group battle in. Oh gosh. Good boy shenanigans with a Triple Fairy Godmother, okay. Not the craziest build ever. Pretty nice unit though. That's a sleigh, that's very good. Our units are pretty strong though. Perfect amount of damage there. Where did you come from? God, and we didn't even have him summon your sheep yet. Okay. And. Okay, we'll 
we're not dead. Kind of funny to me that I'm searching really hard for Hatball and selling upgrade units and stuff, but I'm already top four, yeah. I feel like Peter Pants is actually pretty good at getting top four, but like winning the lobby is really tough. We're probably about to die right here, though, honestly. Um... Level three. I'm trying to find level threes that could potentially get me what I'm looking for. But we're probably dead now. So who in chat would be willing to play? It looks like Mount Mountainous, Mountainous, um, Scott Free or Not Grinner. Anyone else interested? No pie boy here. Oh yeah, we're we're hundred percent dead. Hundred <laughs> percent dead. No wonder I couldn't find another Wizards Familiar. This guy's got... Well, two of them, I guess. It's a good hit. You'd play if you can get SBB to launch. Okay, well, I'll start the group. If we have at least three people, we'll go for it. So, uh, I'm gonna make a cookie time too. Well, I wonder if... Yeah, still, who is it? I forget who it was. That's just been stuck in that group forever. Really? Cookie Time 2 is already in use? Okay, Cookie Time 3. That's the group name. We get at least three people. We'll do, uh, you know, us four versus four bots. So I'll give you all a minute to get in. Cookie Time 3. All right, looks like not Gurner made it. Oh my gosh, really? Get banned, bot. All right, we got two. One more. One more. Just need one more, my friends. No Scott Freeze around. We need to get Math Champ to get this game, I think. Math Champ knows the uh, mechanics for this game pretty darn well for somebody who's never played it. <laughs> Well, I guess we can go us three versus the bots if we don't have anybody else. <laughs> Alright, let's do this thing. Hey, Trophy Hunter, let's get that broken build. Let's do it. It's, um... Grim Soul. Friendly Spirit. Uh, Good Boy. Uh, Baba Yaga. All that kind of stuff. Um. Merry, Merry Christmas, Happy Birthday. If you have a sleigh, I'm giving you the gold. Or the level three, if it's the other cat guy. Alright, I would have lost with any of the choices I took, it looks like. <laughs> okay. I can't get both of them, can I? I kind of do just want you, though. I was hoping I'd get something different. All right. Actually, maybe I do this and freeze for that. I think I am going to do that. Not Gurner. Oh, you have Dracula. Uh-oh. I'm going to get ready to get ranged shot down. Nope. But it did give you the polywoggle. Alright, this is starting really, really poorly. Great. Okay, good into an evil. Interesting. Hmm. 
He transforms. Okay, one four. All right, not bad. Referees for Baby Root, probably not. I wonder if it's better if I do this. More chances for you to not be hit. So we can hopefully get your extra gold. Alright, so what's the first level we can find the units we'd want for this? Grim Souls 4, right? Where's Grim Soul 3 now? I forget. I think it's 4. <sighs> God damn it, man. One out of three, and we lose every goddamn time. Even against frickin' bots who don't know how to play their goddamn units. So frickin' unlucky, man. Okay. Higher level treasure? Okay. Problem is I can't buy any more units if I cast a spell this turn. No two-cost units. Sucks. Okay, well then let's do this. Roll and hope we get another one-cost spell. Okay, that works. Do that, and what do we buy? If I freeze the Brave Princess. I think I do. Can I please, for the love of God, if I had one more gold left this round, it would have been amazing. Can I please get my sleigh one time? Thank God, we get it. If you hit that guy, that'd be amazing. Okay, that's pretty good. Go left. Okay, that's actually not the worst loss ever. Die to bot. It's looking kind of like that, yeah. Should have done the spell first. So I could have got a fancy pants there. Um, Last breath are also slays. Let's go ahead and just get our board filled here. Okay, so this could get me a level 4 treasure. <laughs> Thanks for transforming your polywog. Did you get anything good from it, not Garner? I hope I didn't give you a Shadow Assassin, because... Giving a Shadow Assassin early to Sad Dracula would be, wow, that would be pretty broken. I mean, I sure hope I helped you out that way. You just transformed it into someone else. Oh, did you? Oh, you got a peep that you transformed, gotcha. Cool, he's gonna slay, which will proc it. And proc it. Cool. Alrighty then. Playing against Mrs. Claus, eh? Uh, do we cast this spell? Sure. I don't think I care about doubling you. I'd rather get the gold than the extra thing here. Okay, so we're going to four. We're looking for Grim Soul. Do we care about Copycat? I don't know if you want Copycat or if you just want Grim Soul in the first position slaying. Because that gets the double proc on it, I think is the main thing you want to get. So having a madman behind a support for an extra attack is pretty nice. Oh, we're not freezing for that when we're hopefully getting the units we need next, one of them. 
No sleigh, but that's a oh oh. Do we still get a sleigh? Ah, damn! You got your sleigh. Oh, that's a freaking double hit though. Nice. But, yeah. Okay. Get wrecked. Even though I didn't get my extra gold, did proc that. Okay. Well, there's a friendly spirit. Um. What happens if you do Merlin's test on you on here? I probably should just play it, yeah. Don't want to double the wretched mummy. I think I'd rather look for Grimsoul. Find Grim Soul. Okay, beautiful. So. I feel like that might be too many slays, but once we finish her quest, we probably get rid of her. I wonder if we want only the friendly spirit on the board to proc the thing, to proc the uh, stat buffing buffage. Stat buffing buffage. Okay, and that proc. Okay, well that finished the quest right there. Very nice. You're going to slay. Beautiful. You're going to give stats. We have the start of the broken build, my friends. Give us that gold. All I had to do was play with bots and a couple other friends. <laughs> okay. Permanent buff to that. Perfect. Okay. Random spell. Characters have plus three health. Oh, yes. Okay. So we do this. Um, we want only you guys here. Good into random evil. Okay, we'll transform you, I think. There's a copycat. Copycat, can copycat proc Grim Soul? I feel like I've asked this before and I don't think copycat's part of this build. That's a level four treasure. I think we're done with the quest, so... I think I do want spells still. And I actually want to freeze for this spell to get permanent buff to friendly spirit. here, so let's buy the two twos. Freeze. If you slay, you proc these. If you die, you proc those. I need I need ways to get permanent buffs of the Grim Soul, I think is what we need. Oh yeah, that permanent buff is awesome. Oh, hi, Mountainias. You have... A lot of summons, wow. Okay. <laughs> Hi! Sorry as I kill you. Uh, although your buff's pretty, I mean, your build's pretty good. Sorry I almost killed you, though. <laughs> Alright, so we want, I think we want permanent buffs on Grimsoul to make sure the... Proc is happening on Grim Soul, I think is what I want. So we're slaying on you. I think that's better than putting it on the Friendly Spirit, I think. I want to triple the Friendly Spirit. Oh man, I want that buff too. Permanent buffs I want. Alright, so I'm going to try to clear out this shop because we're going to five. Puff Puff is something you could totally play on Trophy Hunter too, but we're trying another broken thing here. I don't want, I want only, well, 
Last breath, it will trigger that. I, I don't want to do that. Sorry, Puff Puff. We're going to try to Puff Puff meme another day. Trying another broken meme today. Oh gosh, please don't attack. Okay, good. Slay is good. Oh man, every time the friendly spirit slay it procs the stats. This is such a broken... Uh, friendly spirit is so broken on Trophy Hunter. Even though this character's got a really strong... Or this person's got a really strong build. I think we just killed the fates. Get wrecked fates. So we're on five. We're looking for the double slay guy. Okay. Um, if I skip, I could buy this other one. Okay, let's skip. I can sell you and buy this. Okay. All right. Oh, wait. There's only three of us left. Not Gurner as Sad Dracula. You're about to show me how OP you are. Don't kill me too hard, please. See how big your first unit with all the slaying has gone so far. That's pretty big. Giggity, that's what she said. Can I slay? Okay, good. That procs that. Procs it again. You are 53-53. Okay. Alright, you got a pretty nice little prince-princess build going on here. But I think our broken build might be broken enough. Core Wizards go burr. So we're looking for the double slay thing, uh, whatever he's called. You right here. And we want, again, permanent buffs on you, so you get your slay, the double proc it. And now we want to get to six and get good boy as well. Do that because that's actually, I think, more gold worth banked up. All right, we're on our way to the build that we saw the other day. So, what I need, uh, yeah, you, me, and the other botter that's all that's left. What we need is a good unit with ranged, which is how that Robin Wood got so big because good boy was procking all the stats and ended up going on. The good range unit. I guess we could, if we see a uh, the princess curl, maybe grab her to receive all the buffs. Oh man, we just gave him so that random spell just gave him gold and stats. Okay, but we got a lot of stats. Oh, wow. Holy crap! Okay, we're already getting pretty freaking big though. Jesus. Adding the Baba Yaga to that made this insane. Maybe not, Gunner. You can figure out how I should have played to beat this build because this build is looking stupid broken right now. More Baba Yagas I'm looking for. Works. Uh, triple and Grim Soul could be quite good. It's definitely better than that. Okay. Okie dokie, artichokey. All right. Um. Go permanent buffs. Instead of plus one, plus one on them all. 
Good, you lost early. Didn't really have a chance to get that build. Yeah, this build is pretty broken when it comes together, which it's definitely coming together. All right. Oh, I got the uh, I got the ghost. So next turn is six, and that's when we're looking for good boy. When this build really gets broken. Because it's not broken enough yet. <laughs> My god, look at all these stats. Oh, uh, it didn't even slay. Not even that good. What I also need is a second Baba Yaga to be here. 22 damage. So Baba Yaga, okay. Um, do I want the Spell Weaver? I'm not sure if I do. I'm gonna get extra gold, or do I want to look for stat buffs? Uh, okay, more attack. Still wondering if there's a way to make copycat work in this build. I do not want to change my hero, though. Alright, who am I looking for? Good boy. No good boy. <laughs> okay. It's funny that we just have this random 6 9 Cinderella sitting here. I wonder if there was another unit I could have kept that would have been better to keep in that position. Because this isn't nearly as broken as what we played against, because we don't have a good boy transferring the stats to everybody yet. Oh, we pigomorphed your that random spell. Wow, pigomorphed your upgraded unit. That's pretty unlucky. Oh my god, look at how many buffs this is doing. This is insane. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Honestly, it's a pretty big court wizard, but this. This build is just stupid. Oh, nice. You actually killed that. Okay. <laughs> all right. All right. We need we need good boy. Um I don't think I think I just want to look for good boy. We win no matter what. Okay. I mean, we'll do this. Now we can't afford a good boy. There's the Robin Wood. All right, maybe because I want to prolong your suffering, I take a unit out. Let's take out... I don't know if taking any units out will do anything, but I'm going to do this. I'm going to see if my five units can beat your seven units. Now I'm getting cocky. <laughs> Watch me lose now. <laughs> Local man destroys children in online games. Online kids card game. Uh, oh, that was actually the best hit too. Because now I got no proc on it. So I might die now. Do I die? Um... With the ranged... Okay, I don't think I'm dead. Alright. Don't get cocky, kid. I did get cocky. Oh, okay. Uh, cast a spell. Cast it twice. Come on, good boy. Come on, I got like three rolls for good boy. Two rolls for good boy. All right, we're gonna play this guy. There he is, freeze for next game. <laughs> there it is. We found it. There he is. 
I didn't. I don't get him, but I think we're gonna kill you though, because well, I mean, if you if you uh, snipe, well, the thing is, you can't snipe both my friendly spirits. I think the best thing you could do would be to snipe this friendly spirit, and then us not slay with a grim soul, which is I think possible, maybe even likely here. Yeah, I could uh, could pick a morph too. Okay. Okay, that procked on the worst guy, but we did just slay there. So we're going to get pretty big here. Oh, we're going to complete this quest immediately. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, I got a level six treasure and a good boy, and I'll never get to see what those things are because this is so broken. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, oh, man. Well, we know what the new biggest broken build is. Oh, you're not dead! Thank you for not dying! Okay. Um, definitely got, I'm not going to the next turn. These are actually terrible level 6 treasures. So we're going to skip it. We're going to get this. Um, I need to give you buffs somehow. I think we need you to be there. I think maybe the Grim Soul. Hmm. I think we're just gonna. St I'm gonna buy it with you. Buy that. Well, that animation, though. No. Oh, I can't cast another thing. Whoops. Okay. Your game froze on the last door? Oh man, you got Spear of Achilles, though. Uh-oh, here we go. Good boy. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, it's happening, everybody. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh my god. 34,000. I mean, it's not 7 million, but it's pretty good. GG. <laughs> GG. Okay. Pretty good. Pretty good build. I had fun. I'm sorry if the people I played with didn't have fun, but that was fun. <laughs> Alrighty, my friends. Well, thank you to Not Gunner and Mountain... Mountainias? Is that your name? Mountainias for playing... I gotta head out because I do have rehearsal tonight. So, but that was a lot of fun. Uh, hope everyone had a good time. If there's anybody new to the stream, if you did have a good time, hope you get to follow. Come join us again tomorrow. Is another day where I'll probably stream for like an hour or two um, before I gotta go do some gigs. But again, y'all are amazing. Can never thank all you wonderful folks for all the support. Nietzsche for that fifty dollar tip towards the. I think that's went towards the um, thing up here. I can't see it because it's tiny on my little screen. But uh, bits, follow subs, give the subs lurking, all the wonderful, awesome, amazing stuff you all do the sports stream. You know, I couldn't and wouldn't be able to do this more for you amazing people. Until next time, I hope you all have a great rest of your night. Peace out, happy gaming, y'all rock. I will see you all tomorrow. Later, my friends. Enjoy the sea shanty. Later. <laughs>